Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video, as you can tell by the title, is um, a January favorite video. So most of these things are beauty related, but a few things aren't. So I'll leave them to the end of this video. But um, yeah, if you want to know what I've been enjoying the month of January, then just keep watching. Okay, so starting with um, makeup things. The first thing is the Morphe 35O palette. I love this palette because it's very like neutral colors and you've got your more orangey ones here. And it's just so versatile and like every color you would need, like if you're going for a nude natural look is in this palette, which I think is amazing. And the like pigmentation and the payoff of these shades is freaking incredible so i have really really enjoyed this palette this month so the next makeup related thing is just a beauty sponge because recently i have been using a sponge to do my makeup but i have only been using it for like the past month because i did get it in a bella box which if you watch the unboxing you know about it but before i used this this month i only ever used brushes because I had, the first time I used a sponge, it was like a cheap one and it didn't really work. So it kind of put me off them. But this one is great. So, yeah, it's a sponge. <laughs> so the next thing is the um, Maybelline Fit Me Concealer in the shade 10 Light. Um, this is, was the lighter shade at my Woolworths when I got it. And it's too dark to be used as like a concealer because it's not brightening at all. But I have really been loving using just this with no foundation and kind of just blending it out. Which is what is on my face today. I'm not wearing foundation today. I'm just wearing this and like the powders and bronzers and highlighter. But um, yeah, I have been loving this. It blends amazing. It's full coverage. It is perfect. So the second last makeup item is this Pop Feel Eyebrow Pencil, which if you watched my cheap makeup video, you know about this. Um, it was literally a dollar off an app called Joom. Um, and I've got it on my eyebrows today. It is so easy to work with and it's the perfect color for my eyebrows. So I've been loving this. So the last makeup type thing is the OXX Studio Translucent powder which was in my full face of Kmart makeup I keep plugging myself I don't mean to <laughs> I never really use loose setting powders I normally just used like um, pressed powders to set my face but I have really loved using this to set concealer so yeah and this is like six dollars from Kmart so can't go wrong okay so the next thing is the um, Vaseline lip therapy petroleum jelly um, for my lips which is kind of makeup not really makeup more I don't know health for my lips but um, yeah it's just a normal Vaseline um, lip balm which I love to put on my lips it keeps them really moisturized and I apply this like 10 times a day it's like kind of crazy but um, yeah been loving this the next random beauty thing is just this L'Occitane, I think that's how you pronounce it, um, dry skin hand cream, it's amazing, it smells like baby powder, love the smell of baby powder, um, but yeah, it's moisturizing for your hands, and it does work, and I've been loving this, it smells so good, okay, so the last, um, four beauty related things are all face, like, products type thing. So the first thing is this Kmart peel off mask in the scent coconut and it says contains coconut extract which helps to keep your skin hydrated for all skin types paraben and mint free and it just comes in this um, tube and it's what it says it's just a peel off mask and I have been loving putting it like here on my chin and like on my nose because 
they're my most problematic area and um yeah i've used it a couple of times and i am really enjoying it okay so the next thing is kind of like my skincare routine products so the first thing is the um cocoa butter formula skin therapy facial oil which i love to apply it comes with this little you know one of them dropper things and I have loved applying this just to my cheeks and nose area of a night time because I feel scared to put it on my chin and forehead because they are problem areas and um, I don't want pimples. So, been loving that. This just like makes you, when you wake up, your skin is so hydrated and soft. So... The next thing is the um, Olay Total Effects 71 Day Cream, Gentle Day Cream, which I just use as a moisturizer whenever, mostly every morning when I wake up, I put this on before makeup. It is great too, but um, yeah, I have really been enjoying this. It makes my skin soft. It gets rid of like the dry patches and yeah, it's amazing. And the last, like, beauty kind of face thing is the Marvela Skin Vitality Anti-Fatigue Face Mist. So I just use this of a morning when I'm getting ready to wake me up. It is hydrating. Um, I also sometimes spray it after I've done my makeup so then I can have more of a dewy look instead of, um, like, cakey and powdery. So I have really been enjoying this and it actually smells good. So, that's good. The next couple of things are um, fragrances. So, the first fragrance I have been loving this month is the Versace Red Jeans. It smells so, so good. And the bottle is the cutest. So, I've been loving that. And the other one is this one by Police. I don't actually know what the specific thing is, like the actual fragrant name is, but you just take off this flower and then you can spray it and oh my god, if you ever see this anywhere, you have to pick it up and smell it. It's amazing, I promise, I promise. And the bottle is also very adorable. So the next thing is a book, which is very surprising if you know me. I hate reading books. Um, I don't find it very entertaining but this book is amazing so basically um this book is freaking amazing um it, it's also a movie which i have watched probably 10 times um it's so good i've read like this much and i've got this much to read and yeah i will leave like the description on the back is super long so i'm not going to read it to tell you what it's about but i will insert like a picture of it if you want to pause the video you can read it for yourself if you are interested because i know not everyone is interested in books but i highly recommend this one it is so so good so the next um kind of category i guess um of my favorites would be music and every single day every single month every single year of my life i love music it is one of the best things in my life and this month i have really enjoyed being really enjoyed being i have really enjoyed listening to country music and with country music you either love it or you hate it so if you hate it i'm so sorry but um one of my favorites this month is um when it rains it pours by luke combs cobbs i don't know but Yeah, um, I don't want to get copyright, like, striked, and, um, yeah, but if you want to listen to it, it is freaking amazing. I also love this song, and, um, we three finally put it on Spotify.
So those are the two songs that I have been loving this month and have been on repeat. So I guess the next category I could slip in here um, is favourite series, movie, whatever this month. And this month I have been loving Teen Mum OG. I watched the full season um, 20 in like two nights. So freaking love that. Love all of the people in that show. Um, if you don't know what Teen Mum is, then um, where have you been? But um, it's freaking amazing and I highly, highly, highly recommend it. Um, I really want to watch um, the latest seasons of Teen, Teen Mum 2 as well. Because I freaking love reality shows. They're my favourite, all-time favourite. But um, yeah, there are a few things that I have been absolutely loving this month. If you did like this type of video, then let me know so I can make a favorites video every month for you guys i hope that um everyone had an amazing january to start off the year of 2019 and i hope that the year only gets better for everyone who is watching but um with that being said if you did like this video please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe if you want to be a part of this small little family we have here Make sure to love yourself and stay positive and I will see you in my next one. Bye.